Hi, I'm Andrew with Baker's Gas. We're here today with the all-new Bobcat 230. Uh, in this video, we're going to go over the specs of this unit, uh, the capabilities, and uh, just some general knowledge on the 230. Uh, so let's dive right into it. So you can see here, we got a, uh, it's, it's the all-new uh, new casing. It's 100 pounds lighter than the old Bobcat series. It's 13% smaller, so they shrank it up. Uh, fits in the bed of a truck a whole lot better. Um, it's about, roughly about 375 pounds, so it's, it's a lot lighter too. Um, so a couple of the specs on this unit here. We got our generator output. Uh, we got two 240 amp plugs. We got two, well, we got four outlets for 120 volt plugs too, and they're GFCI. So uh, ground fault interrupter, awesome. You got a big breaker here for the 240 plugs, and uh, the, the power output on these. Uh, 9,500 watt continuous, 11,000 watt peak, and it is separate from the welding output. So we got 230 amps on the welding output, so you can push it 230 amps, and we can pull 9,500 watts continuously off the generator. So you could be powering your house in a power outage and welding at the same time, so it's pretty awesome. Uh, this unit, one knob, one switch, so very simple. Um, so th this controls you know, you can either tell it's, it's constant current, constant voltage, so we can put a, put a wire feeder into this. Uh, DC output only. So if we're on stick, right, the outer edge is for stick, and then if we go to wire, the inner edge is our voltage for our wire on our uh, suitcase feeder. No arc reach on this unit, uh, but it'll plug in the old 12VS, 8VS units and uh, run them just fine. We've got our positive terminal, our negative terminal, and then we also have our strain relief here. So if your cable, if you don't have quick connects, you just run your cable down, and then when you're pulling on that cable, this is a strain relief, so it's not gonna jerk on that terminal off here and damage the inside. Uh, just a couple capacities here. We got 11 gallon fuel tank, so longer run times. And then they redesigned the way the wind tunnel works, so it, it keeps the engine cooler, the generator cooler. Pop down the side here. Um, obviously comes, this is your tailpipe, your manual, everything's inside, but we got our generator and then our engine here. Uh, three year warranty on the Kohler engine, three year warranty on the whole unit itself. Um, pretty awesome, very small, very compact, and as you can see I got it up on my table but I can slide it around pretty easily. Um, I had one in the bed of a truck, I can move it by myself, unlike some of the older engine guys that were heavier, harder to move. Um, so very simple as where it goes. When we turn it on, I'll just flip it to run idle. We got our fuel gauge, our hour meter, and then it does have a little wrench that'll pop up if it needs uh, some sort of service. So it's got a pre-programmed 100 hour oil change, 200 hour oil filter change, um, and then we can link down how to, uh, down below on, in, in the manual, where you can read up on all that, how to clear the little wrench light. It's got a manual choke, um, so it's very bare bones and simple. That's it's very nice. So there's only one one part number for this unit, um, and they are in stock and they are available. Um, so all in all, very nice. I I, I like these Bobcats because they're um, they're light. They're little. You can lift them. They got a built-in integrated lifting eye, um, and they run. And they got a lot of power output. So 9,500 continuous watts. If you can remember back the old Bobcats, they were nowhere near that, and they were much bigger, much louder. So they've really redesigned these things. Um, the output on them is awesome. Uh, but next to it, we got the Bobcat 265, so I got that in another video as well. We'll link that down below. So check out, too, also the military special offer. That's included on all engine drives, welding helmets, all the milling gear. Uh, check that out. But if you've got any questions on the Bobcat 230, please link them down below. We'll do our best to answer them. Thanks again for watching and stay tuned for some more.